So this Mua Pitch Box pedal is part of the Micro Series. Um, in this series, there's a bunch of really small, compact, portable pedals for a relatively cheap price. Um, this has quite a bit of weight to it, but it still maintains the nice small size. Um, on the left side of the pedal, towards the bottom, we have the output jack. On the other side, towards the top, we have the input jack. And on the top of the pedal, we have the DC in. There's no room for a battery in this pedal, so you're just going to have to stick with the power supply. Um, on the top of the pedal on the front, we have the toggle switch, which allows us to select from our three modes, harmony, pitch shift, and detune. Um, just below that we have the pitch knob which allows us to customize each of those modes. Below that we have the on and off button and the light to indicate whether it is on and off. That's about it for the pedal itself. Now we'll go into what it sounds like. Harmony mode does is it shifts the pitch and mixes it back with the original signal to create a rich harmonic voice. So this gives you really really nice harmonies and you're going to get a great sound from it. Okay, well first off we will hear the original sound of the guitar so you know what it sounds like and then we'll put some harmonies on. Okay, so here is the original signal harmonising with five semitones up. Here it is harmonising with seven semitones up. goes all the way up to 24 semitones up, so here it is with that. And it goes down to 24 semitones down as well, so here that is. Here's 12 semitones down. And five semitones down. There's a huge variety of um, choices that you can choose from. I've just selected a few that I like most. What this does is it outputs a precise polyphonic pitch shifting voice. So say your guitar is in standard E, you can customise the pitch of that to whatever semitone you want, going all the way up to 24 semitones up and going all the way back down to 24 semitones. So you don't, if you're rehearsing with a band and you want to try out some new songs and then you've learnt the song and then the singer goes, oh, this is in the wrong key for me, can we change it? You don't have to learn the new chords, you don't need to uh, retune your guitar, you just put this on, set it to the semitone that you want and you're ready to go. Um, I'll show you a few examples of this. Here is the original signal again. And here it is set to one semitone up. I'm playing uh, on the exact same fret so you'll hear the difference. Here 
here it is on three semitones up. You can also have it on 12 semitones down. Um, this gives it a nice bass like effect so you can work out bass parts for songs. What this does is it slightly shifts the pitch and mixes it back with the original signal to create a nice chorus-like effect. So I'll just show you a few of these examples. Uh, the first one I'm going to show you is minus 5. Now I'm going to show you it's set to minus 24. I'm going to show you it's set to plus five. Again, with all of these modes, um, there is a huge variety of choice. I've just chosen my favourite few to keep the video relatively short. Um, it's a really good pedal. Um, it's great price, really good value for money. Um, I can't really find any downsides with it. The only one tiny little thing I found is that um, there's a slight delay with the pitch shift about a millisecond if that so it's, you can't really notice it it doesn't really bother me but it is there and it's something to keep in mind um, I think the build quality is really good it's really good value for money and I think um, I'd recommend it to anyone who's looking for a good harmonizing pedal um, but they don't want to spend the money on um, the higher range pedals like the boss pedals thank you very much for watching this has been the Pitchbox by Moore.